Hey guys, welcome to me reacting to SML movie Brooklyn Guy's New Wife by SML. Now, I have not seen this, but uh, this is a Brooklyn Guy episode, and I'm guessing I already kind of know where the plot goes. I, I have a feeling. Uh, I, I hope I'm wrong, because this would just be like, okay, yeah, easy to predict. But my best guess is that Brooklyn guy gets rich or something like that. And then that's how he gets the, the quote unquote new wife. And then at the end, and then there's like some like conflict with uh, Karen. And then at the end, uh, he loses all his money and then uh, Karen goes back to him. That's, that's literally my guess. It, it sounds right, to be honest. But yeah, anyways, guys, we're reaching some description, make sure to SML links. So, some description, let's just get right into it. Yeah, lottery ticket. Oh, God. Going straight into it. I don't know, so I can have a little bit of hope in my life, so I can dream for once. Look, party, it's on! Now, for tonight's winning lottery numbers. The first number is five. Okay, we got one number. Don't get too excited. The second number is nine. Calm down, we haven't even won anything yet, Karen. The third number is 17. Oh God. I'm already gonna pause it here. This bit's gonna be kinda long, I guess, but it, it makes sense. But I'm guessing they're gonna either be, it's either they're gonna win, like get all the numbers, or they're not gonna win and they're gonna be one number off. That That's what's gonna happen. We got 17, we got three numbers, boy, hey. Karen, calm down. Matching three numbers only gets us $7, big whoop. The fourth number is 31. <gasps> 31, 31, 31, 31, 31. Yeah, okay, okay, let's just calm down. Okay, God hates me. Nothing good's ever gonna happen to me, so just calm down. The fifth number is 43. 43. Yeah. <gasps> 43, we got five numbers. Yeah. Five numbers. Interesting freeze frame at the end of that clip. The number that will get you to win a hundred. It's twelve. It's a twelve or fourteen. 13. Oh wait. Thirteen. We got all the money in We just won yeah. fifty million dollars. Actually, it's ninety-four and a half million dollars after taxes, but that's still a lot of True. money. True. Retire. Boy, what are we gonna do with all that money? We should get that some charities. No, screw charity. They already got their money. We should spend this on us. Yeah, yeah. We should buy a yacht with a swimming pool on it, and then I could buy a jet ski and ride my jet ski in the pool on my yacht. I, I could buy one of two chains as chains, and then he'd have to change his rap name to one chain, and then I could be one chain. Oh my God, we could buy an eighty-bedroom mansion and then sleep in a different bedroom every night. But boy, they don't. You just get a nice little house in the mountains and just be together? Ew! No! Of course I don't want that! No, I want my 80-bedroom mansion! Oh my god, we'd have to pay so many maids to clean all those rooms. Oh, but they could all be naked. And then I could pay them to all make out with each other. But boy, what about Whoa, you? that's okay. I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's dark. Yeah, you're right. We should get an island. But not like a really, really big island, because we're not billionaires. No, just like a normal, regular-sized island. Yeah, and then I could hang out on my island with all my maids while they make out with each other naked. Doesn't that sound fun, Karen? W Karen? Karen, where'd you go with the lottery ticket, Karen? No, 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 Karen, what are you doing, my maid? No, okay. Karen, what are you doing? Boy, I heard how you were planning on spending the money, and I think this money would have ruined our lives. Ruined our lives? Did you not hear the part about the 80 naked maids? That would have been a good thing. Boy, haven't you heard the horror stories of people winning the lottery and then ruined their lives? Well, well, yeah, but those people didn't spend their money on 80 naked maids in an island. That, that, that would have made them happy. Boy, I think I did the right thing. No, no, I want my island and my yacht and my jet ski. Now we can't even get one okay. naked maid. Boy, I'll be your naked maid. Ew! Boy, all we need is our love. Ugh, I don't want love, I want maids. Breaking news, Mute. The winning ticket for the $150 million lottery was sold in our town and is still unclaimed. So make sure you check your tickets. Oh, oh. Would you look at that? The ticket still hasn't been claimed. I wonder why somebody wouldn't claim a winning lottery ticket. Maybe it's because their stupid, ugly wife shredded it. Okay, so now it's... All we need is a lot. Okay, I didn't expect All this part. Ready. This is my dinner. Boyney, you can't have beer for dinner. Why? It'll kill me slower than your cooking will. Boyney, I worked really <laughs> hard all day on this dinner. That's but actually a good line. to cook at all if we had 80 naked maids to cook for us. Boyney, that's 80 naked maids, not 80 naked cooks. Well, we could we could buy some that could cook, you know, and they could make out naked while they cooked. It would be dinner and a show. Boyney, be dinner and a show. Jeez. I'm going to kill her. 
I'm, I'm, no, yep, yep, yep. I'm gonna kill her. I'm gonna kill her. How do I kill her though? Poison. Yep. Yeah, it'll be poison. No way. I did poison. not expect and that. They'll think it's poison. They'll just think she died from eating her crappy food because it's always bad. Hey there. What can I get you? Poison to kill my wife, and I don't want them to be able to trace it back to me. Oh, all right. I think I got just the thing. There you go. It's called drop dead. You put some of that in your wife's food, and she'll drop dead. No. Dude, chance. this is interesting. Okay. Burned lasagna. Boy, boy, look. I put pink lemonade in a wine glass because I want to feel fancy. You could have had real wine at the top of the Eiffel Tower and eaten lasagna cooked by the rat from Ratatouille. Boy, his name was Remy. I don't care what his name is. With all that money, we could have bought the rights to Ratatouille and changed his name to Lasagna. Okay, now you're just being silly. Eat nah, it. not true, it's but burned. I get it's it. It's slightly overcooked. Slightly. That's like saying the Titanic is slightly underwater. Boy, eat your lasagna. <laughs> Okay, good, good bit. It's stinky. What? The lasagna is stinky. It's <laughs> stinky. stinky lasagna. Stinky and lasagna. Hurtful words as a weapon, but you're it's stinky. To be rude. Well, you're using lasagna as a weapon because it's stinky, and I think it's trying to kill me. Well, put some ketchup on it or something, Boydy. Oh, what's the? I, I, I have ketchup. Yeah, he, he, here's my ketchup. Why? Why is it orange, Boydy? Oh, because it's the Shrek kids Nickelodeon ketchup. Yeah, that's it. Ooh, boy. The whole bottle. Boy, you don't want any? No, no, and ruin the flavor of this stinky lasagna? No, of course not. It's it, it's pretty gooey, Boydie. Yeah, yeah, just get it all on there. Boydie, it looks yummy. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Make sure you eat all of it. Really I mean, quick. it makes sense that she would... Boy, that was so delicious! It's obviously slime. But my stomach's starting to hurt, Boydie. Yeah, well, that happens every time we eat your cooking. But you don't feel like you're gonna die? My cooking's not that bad, Boydie. Mm, we'll see. I feel perfectly fine. She's finally gone! Yeah. Free. Dang! Complete subvert of expectations. Wow. Did not expect that, actually. Because they, they teased me. They teased me at the beginning with the lottery ticket. And, yeah, they teased me. They totally teased me. Because they made me think that he was going to get rich. But no. He... I mean, maybe he does, but but no, they completely subverted my expectations. I did not expect this. I did not. I did not expect this at all. And, and I'm a doctor too, so I can pronounce it dead. And I'm a cop, so I won't get arrested for this. But 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 I should probably still call a cop just so it doesn't look suspicious. Yeah, I'll go call my friend. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna call my partner Bruce. Hello. Hey, Bruce. What's up? Oh, uh, not much, mate. Just watching the news. Hey, did you see where the hundred and fifty million dollar winning lottery ticket was sold in our town? No, no, I didn't see that. That's crazy, mate. Who do you think it was? Not me. <laughs> oh yeah. Can you imagine how many naked maids you could buy with a hundred and fifty million dollars? Probably about eighty. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. But oh my God! Of course he knows. Oh, uh, my wife. It's, it's terrible. You know? Oh no! Did she make lasagna again? Yeah, it's, it's really, really bad this time. I need you to come over right away. But I'm not hungry. No, no, no. Something bad happened to my wife. Did you finally snap, mate? <laughs> no, 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 no. Just, just come over. All right, mate. I'll be right there. All right. Now when he gets here, I gotta cry and pretend I didn't know she was gonna die. Boydy, Boydy, what happened? I feel like I hit my head. Karen? What? You're hot. But I feel kind of cold, actually. No, 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 no. You, you, you are hot. Oh, thank you, boy day. No, 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 no. You, you don't, you don't understand. You, you weren't hot, and now you are. What do you mean? Well, just come with me to the mirror. Look, look, look at you. Oh my God, boy day, I'm gorgeous. Yeah, you're hot. You're smoking hot. Boy, day, it must have been the lasagna. No, no, I, I don't think it was that. But I do have a pretty good idea what it was. Boy, day, you should. Have of that lasagna. I am never touching that lasagna. Wait, wait, wait. Are you saying I'm not hot? Oh, boy, do you hot to me? Mm. Well, look, <laughs> the bedroom. Why, boy? Okay, you yeah, know? that's a com- Whoa! Boy, they- More like boy, yo, 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 Yep, that's me. Boy, they, you've never loved me that hard before. Well, you were ugly. Boy, they! Well, you're hot now, so it doesn't matter. Who's at the door, boy, they? Oh, I'll get it. Yeah, hello? Jeez, mate, why are you naked? <laughs> what? Oh, this. Why don't you come in and see? All right. There. 
That right there is why I'm naked. Pointy, what are you doing? I'm in bed! Oh, good on you, mate. You got yourself a tin. Is that the same girl from the bar the other night? What? No, 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 no. The girl from the bar was ugly. This is my wife. That is not your wife, mate. Your wife is hideous. No, no, she was hideous, but she's hot now. Oh, I get it. You divorced the hideous one and got yourself that one. No, no, it's the same person. It's just now she's hot. Well, I know you don't make enough money to pay for plastic surgery, mate. No, no, she just poofed like this. Poofed? Yeah, poofed. Oh, well, do you mind if I take her on a date after you're done with her? No, it's my wife! That is not your wife! Your wife is hideous! <laughs> oh, just get out of here! Oh, Dude, right. Bruce is a god. <laughs> I'm sorry, baby. Just, just stay right there. I, I, I gotta go make a phone call. I should call that dolphin and see what's going on. Hey, who's this? Uh, I'm the guy you sold that poison to. Oh, hey. Did it work? Is your wife dead? Uh, no. She's actually just smoking hot now. Wh what? Yeah, yeah. She ate the poison, and now she's just, like, really, really hot. Oh, I messed up. Wh what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, see, I was supposed to give you the drop-dead poison, and instead I gave you the drop-dead gorgeous potion. So whoever drinks that turns into somebody who's drop-dead gorgeous. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. All right, that's fine. I mean, if you want to come back, I'll give you the poison instead. No, 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 no. No, no, this is good. I like that she's hot. Uh, well, I mean, I should probably tell you that. No, 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 don't, 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 don't worry about it. I got it. <laughs> it's going to wear off. Yeah. Well, I should probably tell you that there's something. Yeah, it's going to wear off. It's going to wear off. It's going to wear off by the end of the video. Okay. But I will say... Did not expect this. Actually did not expect this. That... I actually kind of like that they did that. They subverted my expectations. I, I did not expect that. Yeah, that's the thing. They, like, teased the audience there. Which is interesting. It's like they knew that if they did that plot, it would be predictable. So they, te they like, teased that that would be the plot, and then they switched it on us. Like... <laughs> Which actually is kind of interesting. Actually interesting to me. Okay. All right. Well, that's great. I got a hot wife. That's way better than 80 naked maids. So, Boily, what do you want to do now? Whatever my beautiful, perfect wife wants to do. Really? Whatever I want to do? Yeah. Well, normally you just want to sit in the living room and drink beer. Well, yeah, but you're hot now. Boily, I would love to go to the movies with you. Well, okay. Like in public? Yeah, sure. And then can we get ice cream afterwards? Yeah, of course. Whatever you want. Okay. Boyne, I'm so excited to be at the movies. You haven't taken me out in years. Well, yeah, Roy, really get her. I didn't want to be seen with you in public, but now you're hot. Your eye candy, and I got a sweet tooth. Well, my eyes have a sweet tooth. My eyes have teeth. Boyne, this is why I love you. You have such a way with words. <gasps> Boyne, the movie's starting. Oh, hey, you know what we should do? We should make out. But Boyne, I want to watch the movie. Oh, come on, you're hot. I want to make out. Boyne, the movie's on. The movie's stupid. Let's just make out. Boyne, stop it. Oh, hey there, sweet cheeks. Are, are you talking to me? What other supermodel would I be talking to? Oh, boy, they hate that I look like a supermodel! Of course, Karen, you're hot. People are going to say that kind of stuff. Just ignore them. Hey, babe, did you know that there's only 20 letters in the alphabet? I thought that was 26. Oh, yeah, how could I forget? You are a QT. You're still missing one. Oh, yeah. I'll give you the D later. Boyne, he's so charming. He's only saying that stuff because you're hot. He wouldn't have said that stuff yesterday, so he should just stay out of it. Back off, old man. Old man? This is my wife. Ha! Yeah, in your dreams. Well, oh, hey, you want to go outside, bro? Huh, bro? You stupid TikTok haircut? Go make some TikToks. Oh, yeah, no, actually, I'm right here next to your wife. The fact that they Boyne, made... Are you jealous? No, I'm not, I'm not jealous of him with his stupid perfect TikTok hair and his beautiful blue eyes. But Boyne, you have blue eyes. Yeah, but I'm like all old and I'm losing my hair and I got cataracts. Let's just go. Okay, Boyne. Call me later, sweet stuff. Yeah, so it's the opposite. I'm gonna call you. Uh, okay. So it's like the opposite I'm be effect. At home where nobody else can stare at you but me. Okay, Boyne, but you don't have to get so jealous. I'm not jealous. So it's like Is the it opposite cool? effect. Oh, I'll get it. Oh, I wanna go with you. Hello? Hey there, it's me, famous Hollywood talent agent Steve Staleberger. Really? The Steve Staleberger? Yeah, what this character. Doing? Well, I just couldn't help but notice you and your wife leaving the movies, and I thought your wife was smoking hot. I think she could be the next Marilyn Monroe. <gasps> Boy, he thinks I could be the next Marilyn Monroe! 
Really? Yes. All she has to do is get on my private jet to Hollywood, and I'll make her a professional model. Boynie, if I become rich and famous, I can take care of you. I can get you your yacht and your private island. But, but, but you'll be gone all the time, and I won't be able to see you. Yeah, but I wouldn't cook you gross meals anymore. Hmm. Okay. Great. Come with me, babe. <laughs> my wife's going to be gone now. But no more bored lasagna, and she's hot. I guess I'll just sit here, since my wife is going to be in Hollywood, and she's going to be gone for a while. But she's still hot, though. But uh, I'm not going to be able to see her, because she's in Hollywood with all those other... Yeah, so he's actually kind of, like, sad. It's like the other way around. You know, but she's not going to cheat on me, even even though I'm bald and, and I have cataracts. But, but, but no, 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 she, she, loves, she loves me. Who's at the door? Oh, you know what? I bet it's my wife. Yeah, she she probably wants to go again one more time before she goes to Hollywood, cause cause no one there is gonna be hot, hotter than me. Hello? What, Karen? Hi, Boyne. What the hell happened? We were just getting on my mm, private jet, and all of a sudden she turned into this thing. Boyne, am I so pretty? Mm, yeah. Not as much, no. The deal's off. Boyne. Just come inside. We're gonna figure this out. Oh, Boyne, I wish I was still alive. He's gonna call the dolphin. Just calm down. I'm gonna figure out what happened. Hey, 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 hey! My wife's not hot anymore. What happened? Oh, well, what I was gonna say before you yeah. hung up on me is that the potion only lasts for about an hour. What? 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 Do you have any more? No, that was the last bottle of drop dead gorgeous potion I have. But I still have the poison if you want it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. Karen, Karen, stop okay. crying. But, Boydie, I can't get you your yacht or your private island. Well, you know, I, I don't want a private island that bad. What about your 80 naked maids, Boydie? Uh, Karen, you're, you're as good as maybe half a naked maid. Really, Boydie? Okay. Yeah. Oh, Boydie, I love you so much! I have feelings for you as well, Karen. Actually... Not bad. I, I actually enjoyed it. I thought it was a good video. I I enjoy the humor, and yeah, I, I like what they did with the plot there. I was not expecting that. I will say with the end, it is interesting for Karen's character, because yeah, it's like she wants to get him those things, even though he she tore up the lottery ticket before. I guess it's because she wanted to do it like she was doing it for him, and like, you know... Basic, basically saying that like, oh, the lottery ticket was the aid rather than like she was the aid, I guess. But I don't know how that really changes. I don't know. I, yeah, I don't really know. Either way, I think this plot was, yeah, it was actually not what I expected. It subverted my expectations in a interesting way, I'd say. I, I did not expect it to go this route. I will say that, yes, the plot did get pretty predictable after Brooklyn guy hung up on him, like on the lone dolphin, and that's I think where the plot started to go downhill because then it was more of just like, well it didn't really feel like filler because it kind of just showed the opposite effect of it, you know, what oh, like, she's she's, uh, beautiful you know, yeah, and yeah, like she's quote unquote beautiful, so now everybody's like, not gonna leave her alone whereas, and yeah, so now it's like, oh yeah, so Brooklyn guy's jealous, so he doesn't- he does the exact same thing as if she were ugly, cause, well, ugly, cause, you know, he's jealous. So it's like the other way around, it's like the opposite. But, yeah, honestly, this was- this was an interesting video, I actually enjoyed it, I thought it was good. But yeah, anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the like video, share my channel, see you in the next one, bye!